Alright, hello and oh, welcome back. In the last episode, in case you missed it, we traveled to this new episode in Silly, where we're competing in a plane competition, and we're on the hunt to sabotage our opponents, because we are the heroes and it is necessary. And let's just jump into it. We have a mission for quite a bit of people, starting with Murray and uh, Sly. But I'm going to start off with this. Oh, is it turning around? Yes, he is. We also bought a smoke bomb, which we are going to test out. As soon as this guy turns around, so we can go ahead and rob him, because there's a lot of cool schools that, skills that I want to get. Hey! Ooh, 107. Nice! Goodbye. Do you have stuff? We also bought the paraglide skill as well. Do you have any goodies, my friend? No, you're useless. Abua, uh, is that cheese that I just bounced on? Not very hygienic. All right, see that armored supply truck? It's en route to drop off Team Iceland's lucky ice sculpture for the semifinals tomorrow. I've given the drivers some bad directions, so they should be going around in circles for hours. We need you to get inside that truck, steal the sculpture, and plant some evidence implicating Team Belgium. Good thinking. Team Iceland won't be gunning for me if they think the Belgians stole their lucky hunk of ice. Well, that's the idea. Now the first thing to do is steal one of Team Belgium's official gold lace monogrammed handkerchiefs. Of course. Murray will head inside and get one of those stodgy Belgians laughing. They're notoriously stone-faced. Then I'll move in and steal the handkerchief. Seems like getting inside that truck might be a good job for the guru. He could use some of the guards' heads to bash in the back doors. Agreed. I'll make sure he's in position. Murray, get your lavacious self in there. And I just made that word up. Does that make it up? It might be a real word. I don't know. No pressure. But you've got to find a Team Belgian pilot and get him laughing so hard that Bentley can make the pull. This is serious business, pal. Those guys are uptight. If they Hello, Belgium Flyer! Do you like comedy? I think it's time for <laughs> Mr. Salty Pants to crack a smile! What do you say? Why don't we just steal it from him? I suppose political humor is very dicey, but it might work out. Why did the chicken cross the road to France? Because it wasn't turkey. And you see, the chicken's not a turkey oh, or boy. a turk. It's a chicken, mm. a French hen. You should never have to explain a joke. Otherwise, it's no longer good. Let's go with intellectual humor. I can't make heads or tails of this coin. <laughs> Get it? It's totally funny because, like, when you flip a coin, it comes out either heads or tails. Come on, that's comic gold. That's barely comic browns, bro. All right, historical humor with Belgians. I don't know if that's a good thing. What was Genghis Khan's favorite meal? Mongolian beef. The brains of his enemy. Get it? I mean, it's more weird and gross than funny, but I... I mean, you gotta admit, it's pretty weird. Ever see someone put their fist down their throat? ta -da! Hey, fish! Duck! <laughs> Murray. <Yeah. laughs> hey! That's, uh, that's not a joke. It's something very, very different. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Bentley, it's go time. Make the pull while the Belgian's laughing, or he's sure to feel you fishing for the handkerchief. Hey, thief! What? How, Bentley? Make the pull while he's laughing, and he won't feel a thing. <laughs> So I can pickpocket with Bentley now? That's nice. It's pretty cool. 
Nice work. Meet me outside with the goods. It's up to the guru now. Murray, please stop whatever you're doing, my friend. It's very disconcerting. I mean, love is love, but... Bentley's en route to your me with fist? a monogrammed handkerchief, but we'll never be able to swipe the ice sculpture unless we can get into that armored truck. I agree. The back door should be its weak spot. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure the guards around here won't mind too much if you break the door down with their heads. <laughs> Bentley set up a waypoint on the truck. Should be handy. The thing's moving pretty fast. You know, for a guy of peace, he sure as hell does use violence a lot. His body count is, like, extremely high. Alright, where is this truck? There it is. I hope there's not a time limit on this. Stand still, you It's a good start, but the truck just powered up its automated defenses. You'll have to pay attention on your next approach. Could get sticky. Come on. Dog? It's a dog, right? Yeah. Alright, there should be another dog right here. Fluffy tailed little bastard. Get over here. Ah, damn it. Can you stop getting knocked out, dude? Thank you. There it is. Oh, they're rabbits. Why was I thinking they're dogs? Because I have no common sense, that's why. Come here. Car. Truck. Tank. Armored vehicle of some sort. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, boy. I'm gonna hit it. Nice. Hey. Yes, we got it. You have an infinite amount of bear traps. My defense, I didn't think going head first into a metallic structure would knock this dude out. Clear Wait, what what did I just hit? Should be making its approach any minute now. Or maybe not. It's going the opposite direction. Oh, don't get run over, bunny rabbit. Nice work, Guru. The back doors are still holding tight, but the top of the vehicle's been blown wide open. Motherfucker has more traps than junk rat. Okay, Sly, your turn. You'll have to sprint hard to catch up, but jumping inside through the roof should be easy. Moving on to a moving vehicle and landing on the roof. That's how it to you. <laughs> the arrogance of this man. Is it coming this way? If it is, I might as well just wait. I'm assuming. I mean, it's a road here, so... 
Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's just taking the scenic route. Any day now. I could have taken a lap of this area like four times before I actually approached. Don't tell me it's going over the bridge. Okay. Come on. Oh, you, you, you cheeky, cheeky bastard. This is it. Crack the safe and make the swap. No pressure, but I think the driver has figured out where to go. You don't have much time. Got it. Wait, what? I don't know why it didn't go the first two times, but that's fine. Great work. Team Iceland is sure to blame the Belgians. They'll be all over each other in tomorrow's dogfight. I love creating international incidents. It's just so much fun. Okay, so I don't have any other missions for the Slyas of Coopers, do I? No. Let's go switch to Murray. So let's go see if we can't rob somebody around here. Do you have anything good? You do. He has the shinies. A nugget? How much? 51, that's it? Just tell me you're broke, bro. It's okay. Turn around, dog. Sixty-four. All right, let's get back to the safe house. Wait, I can. <laughs> I can go freaking Assassin's Creed on this thing. Nice. Let's see if I can actually buy anything else. 300 gold coins. Extend your jumps by hovering in the air. That's very useful. Murray is already kind of the best character here, so I don't want to give him too much. I gotta show Bentley some love. Hover back. I feel like that's gonna come in super useful. Murray, it's your time to shine, my friend. Can I reach that? Not a chance in hell. Looks like hard partying team Iceland has already gone to sleep. Time to borrow one of their Viking helmets. Why do you need me? Just have Sly pick the lock to the door and steal the thing. This is a delicate business. We're trying to frame team Iceland for a crime they haven't committed. If there's any evidence of their door being forced, people might believe that they're innocent. Man, you've gotten devious over the years. So, uh, how are we supposed to get inside? There are some sewer pipes beneath town that should connect up with the ventilation system of the hotel. Sly scrounged a raft for the trip, but be careful. Other pilots have caused trouble down there in the past, and the Baron is sure to have set up some security. I get to row a boat? 
through sewer water. You do realize the sewer water part is gonna be kind of gross. By kind of gross, I mean completely disgusting. Murray, use the left analog stick to steer the raft. Press the X button to row forward and the square button to row backwards. Got it. Okay, and I have to continuously tap it. Got it. Uh, inverted. Oh, no, no, actually inverted. I just can't get a sense of direction. I'm tapping X as hard as I can, and this thing is not moving. Oh boy. No, no, no. Oh wait, it's not toxic. I assumed it was, that's why I was trying to go around it. Ah, there are the land mine the sea mines. I said land mines. You know, for sewer water, this water is surprisingly I don't want to say clean, but you can see through it. It's -a me, Mario. Can I do this perfectly? Oh boy, this is gonna. Wait, how the hell am I supposed to? actually get past that. I like that, I guess. Okay. I love how they're supposed to push you in a direction, but you can just go through them. You know, Murray, this has been quite an easy ordeal. System. Let's do Murray, it. Stay and guard the boat. What is the purpose of these moving structures? I am curious. Get up there. Oh, oh boy, that's mm. that's gonna be an interesting shower later. Dude, for the love of all that is holy, we do not want to get into the sewer water again. There we go. A stack of cards that make no noise, but okay. Can I rob these guys? No, I can't. Don't you have them? No. You're the responsible one here. Let's just bang on the door. Oh, no, everyone there is asleep. I'm not gonna wake them all up. Those guys who shoot at us tomorrow if we do that. Nice work. Head back to Murray and the raft. Fine. We'll just go down to the front desk and ask for a spare. You can forget about me and being the wingman tomorrow. These aren't even freaking. These guys are paranoid, and this is what they did. They left a giant open. <laughs> Freaking vent! And I even put like a little bit of marbles there. Like, come on, guys. If you're gonna be paranoid, be paranoid. Inefficient. Hey, Murray. Um, can you swing by and pick me up? I don't feel like going through this again. But I guess I don't have much of a choice. Oh man, I cannot get this one right here. Okay, there we go.
If he's on the other side and I have to and I went the wrong direction. Oh no, he's right there. Go over there. Sorry, pal. The valve gates changed position. We need to escape through another tunnel. But fear not. The Murray has an unnatural sense of direction. Steer with the left analog stick. Press X to move forward. Oh, they're moving now. This might prove difficult if they weren't moving so incredibly slow. Granted, I'm not exactly in the speedboat myself, so. Oh, my ear itches. We're in a sewer. There's spike balls. That was... I just stopped and let that dude hit me, but okay. But yeah, sewer, spike balls, all I need is a freaking, uh, and there's a turtle. This is basically Mario. I was perfect the first time, and now I have become what I hate. Poorly coordinated. Get over there. Oh, okay. I can only take one more ball before I... Am I stuck? Oh, boy. Okay, there we go. Sorry, pal. The valve gates changed position. We need to escape through another tunnel. But fear not. The Murray has an unnatural sense of direction. The Murray is about to get punched in the face if he continues to refer to himself as the Murray. Sorry, I know violence is not the right way. But, you know. Sometimes your friends do things that annoy the crap out of you. Well, let's just say that's one of them. Get over there! I should probably hold off. Let me just wait until it does one more pass. Come on! We can do this! Damn, these things are super slow. There's like zero need for caution. I'll take that. That's fine. I could still take two more balls to the f <laughs> before I blow up. Uh, can I make it? There we go. Okay. Get over there, Murray! Land ho! What'd you just call my mama? Nice job. You really showed some finesse with those oars. The Murray is, and always has been, finesse. Uh, yeah. You good to plant this helmet on the Belgian plane? Can do, pal! Can do with a vengeance! So we're just gonna run straight to it, I suppose. And I immediately took a wrong turn. That's cool. You know, 
you guys are not very cool about me running through spotlights. I don't know why you're angry. Wait, what the hell did I just hit? Oh, I was looking for health and I almost died. Let's just go ahead and run. Oh boy. That's Belgium's prize plane strung up from the ceiling. It's held in place by these anchors. Destroy them and the plane should come crashing down. Seems like these lasers might roast my hulking bulk. True. You'll have to compact yourself using your ball move to travel safely beneath the laser grid. Check. You'll need to use your charged ball attack to take out the anchors. Go into ball form and quickly tap the square button to build up force. Then strike. Quickly press square in a ball mode. Okay. I did that on purpose, of course. You know, I, um, I had to. Timing on this is very tight. Bro. Nice job. Okay, just three got it. More to go. Oh, just three more. Got it. Ooh, please, game, thank you. That plane looks ready to fall. Just one more left. Excellent work. Plant the Viking helmet and the Belgians are sure to blame Team Iceland. What about the whole, oh, the lasers went off grid. Of course they did. I am the Murray. God, even I've started calling myself in third person. I think I still have two more missions for the pink hippo. One right there. Oh, just one. Well, either way, we are going to end the episode here. In the next episode, we will finish the Cooper Hanger defense, apparently. As always, if you do like the episode, do consider hitting like and subscribe. Great way to support the channel. Great way to help it grow. And I will check you all next time.